Hello, you're watching James. My name's James, you're watching me, and I am talking about watches. Well, today I'm featuring a very special watch, a watch from Houtman. Houtman is a watch brand based right here where I live in Western Australia. And because I am talking about an Australian brand, I thought I should wear my Australian uniform. This is my Wallabies rugby top, and that's why I'm wearing it today. Now, Jason, the owner of this company, was nice enough to come over to my house and drop off samples of a few of his watches. And what surprised me so much is that when I put this Pilbara, which is the one I'm going to be speaking about today, on my wrist, well, I loved it so much that I had to jump onto his website almost immediately and buy one for myself. Yes, I paid full price. I didn't get a discount. I jumped on there and went, I want one of those watches. And I'm releasing this video today because I want you to be aware, if you are interested in one of these Houtman Pilbaras, well, the prices go up tomorrow. So if you are interested, jump on the website and you should buy one. I'm going to leave a link down to the website in the description of this video. Now today I'm just doing a first impressions of the Pilbara because I've got my own variation coming very soon in the mail and I'll be doing a full in-depth review of that particular variation. So the prices right now, before they go up tomorrow, are 599 Australian dollars for this variation and a few of the other variations. For the one that I bought, which is called the Pilbara Rock, which has a really cool, interesting dial, it's a tiny little bit more money at $619. And I really hope in this first impressions video to get across to you how good this watch actually is. Because I have to say that I saw lots of pictures of it, I watched all the reviews on it, and I thought, wow, that's a really cool, interesting watch, uh, but probably not for me. But as soon as I put it on wrist, as soon as I sort of felt the quality of it, the look of it, and how it sits on my wrist, as I said, I jumped onto the website and I bought myself one. So I really do hope that that comes through in this video. And when I do the full in-depth review of it, I'm gonna really, really push and emphasize all those little bits and pieces that really stood out to me. Now guys, if you have not subscribed to this channel, I would really appreciate it if you just click on that little subscribe button. But let's flip the camera around now and let's check out this Houtman Pilbara. So as I mentioned, this is going to be a first impression style video, but it's going to be a first impression style video with a little bit more detail to it. And that is because the price of these guys are going up tomorrow. And I want to give you as much information as I can before that price goes up. And I'm definitely going to do a full in-depth review. And I'm going to do the full in-depth review of the watch that I just bought. Because I had this watch on wrist for less than an hour. And I loved it so much and it sat so well on my wrist that I jumped onto the site and bought one for myself. So in the future, I'll be releasing a full in-depth review of the one that I've actually purchased. And whilst doing this video, I'm being wearing the Houtman Merchantson, which is his other watch that uh, Jason has in his watch collection series. But today we're talking about the Pilbara. Comes in this very nice leather pouch. Really quite impressive, actually. Very, very soft leather. Feels very, very nice opens up we have a watch obviously we have a rubber strap we have a adjusting screwdriver we have a warranty card from jason nice little uh thank you from jason as well as well as some information they have a two-year warranty which is absolutely fantastic i do like to see that and here we have the blue version of the houtman pilbara and for anybody out there who's interested in one of these watches, it's pronounced Pilbara. Pilbara. I'm from the exact same location as Jason, the owner of this company, is from. The Pilbara is a region north of where we live. It is a very desert sort of area, very, very dry and very hot area. And there's a lot of red dust. It is red everywhere. And that is his sort of inspiration for these watches. He's released this in a few different variations used in sort of the natural world of Australia around us to inspire each different dial variation. And it does obviously come in five different dials. This one here is the blue. Um, we then have the rock. And this is the one that I've just bought. And this is the one that is going to feature in the full review. But there is also a white salt, a jade, and a black. Now looking at the dial of this one, it is beautiful and I really do like this blue, but that Pilbara Rock just looks so cool and so different that I need to own that particular one. It does cost a tiny little bit more than these variations, but I think it is worth it for me. It has a real nice transition from blue through to black. We have a 
really sort of applied sort of indices track so the whole thing sort of looks like almost like a sandwich dial sat on top with the indices inset so they almost float on top of the dial which is very cool loom on those of course we have a brushed set of hands very squared off hands i really quite like them actually little bits of loom in there nice long second hand with a loom pip on there as well this is all covered by a slightly double domed sapphire crystal with ar coding inside here we have the miota caliber 9039 premium high beat movement and we've also got 200 meters of water resistance printed on the dial is houtman we've got automatic 200 yes 200 meter diver and then we come to one of the features that i like most about it which is the bezel which has an aluminium sandblasted insert which has then been ip coated and it gives it a really cool interesting look to it it also has a really really nice ratcheting sound to it very solid zero back play really really spot on it also lines up completely perfectly which is really cool to see i'm very happy about that not all watches in the more affordable realm do line up perfectly but this one absolutely does it has a coin edge bezel so it's very nice to hold on to has quite a nice amount of resistance as well so you're not going to accidentally knock this one and one of the things i absolutely love about this watch is not only the quality the fit the finishing but the choice of finishing i love how he's gone for uh, brushing on the top a polished chamfered edge and brushing on the side that is my favorite combination brushed polished brushed and the brushing is very nice the chamfered edge is very nice and i like how it comes all the way down the sides then down onto the lugs as well very 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 cool i'm really quite impressed by it as i mentioned i had this on wrist for a very short period of time and i jumped on the website and i bought one for myself at full price now the loom is really cool not only have we got lots of loom here but we've also got loom on the crown now i do apologize for the slightly shaky loom video i'm holding this one in my hand so i can show it to you properly as well as that crown loom that crown is unguarded has a nice grippy surface to it very easily unscrewed you can see the thread is there giving you the 200 meters of water resistance we then have hand winding no ghost position on this miota movement which is absolutely fantastic but we also do have hacking a really nice feeling and looking movement to have inside this watch now i really like the bracelet on this one solid end links nice and firm female end links so they do drop away there's also a lot of curvature to this case anyway so it's one of my favorite parts of this watch um, all brushed all brushed and looking at the links themselves it does look like five individual links but it's not it's one individual link doesn't affect the performance of it at all but it does uh, not have the individual links just for your awareness it does have screw pins there we do have a solid clasp with twin pushes and a completely milled inner and it comes with three sets of micro adjust and then we have a fantastic nicely 3d etched background there this is the red dog uh, if you are unaware up north there's a story of a, a red dog and his and his master they've made a movie out of it and this is the, the red dog that they're featuring on the back of the case and if we look closely on that bracelet we're going to see quick release spring bars which is very cool, makes it easy to swap out for a nice leather strap if you want to put it on or put it onto the rubber that's supplied. I have been assured that if you don't like the quick release spring bars, they are quite easy to uh, change out so you don't have those quick release spring bars there. The rubber strap that it comes with feels really, really cool. substantial, really good, really quite impressed by that. But let's check out this watch on wrist, shall we, and see why within such a short period of time that I bought myself one. So here we have it on my six and three quarter inch wrist and you can probably see why i bought it so quickly it just sits perfectly on my wrist but then you look down the wrist and it just sits so flat now on camera i'm sort of being a little bit sort of weirdly positioned so it doesn't sit perfectly but when i'm in real life it sits dead flat really curved to my arm it's like it's made for me what a gorgeous looking watch now guys this is just in first impressions i know i've gone in depth a little bit more i do want to do a full in-depth review once i get mine arrive on the doorstep i'm really excited to have that variation arrive so i can then wear it lots and give you a nice fuller in-depth review and when i do so i'll be giving you a whole heap of more information about sizes and see how that miota movement is working and guys if you are interested in this watch as i've mentioned the prices are going up tomorrow so jump onto the website i will leave a link to the website directly into the description of this video 
I'm not affiliated with Hartman. I'm not earning any money out of it. That's just a link straight through to the website. But yeah, the prices are going up as of tomorrow. So if you are considering one, worthwhile jumping on now. As always, thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. And I do hope to see you in the next video.